go! Whoa! This cannot be the correct. You guys okay? You look okay! Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo-gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? Okay, I've got two conduits here. Someone tell him to turn them on. Thanks, buddy. Nothing's happening. Gamora, tell him to check the power supply. It's empty. Then tell him to find a battery. Did you catch that? Yeah, yeah. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? Might be just what we need. Okay, got us a battery. Took him long enough. Hey, I'm trying, man. And we're still floating around. Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening. Seriously? Uh, fine, I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath. Tell me what you see. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay, okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain surgery, just pick one. I have begun to enjoy this weightlessness. It feels like when Hovat and I fell in love. We were shoved, Nick. Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! You touched the green thing, didn't you? Are you great? Well... Uh, 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 everybody! Just... Oh, no. uh, 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 Gravity was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what. Uh. Uh. Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we found so far? What do you mean, code word? Fine. Brood won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? The code word is sweep the leg. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. We should also standardize our use of the term dog report item to distinguish information of interest to our investigation. Yep. Sure thing, buddy. Dog report item. Something caused Novacore to abandon the ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. Was that a crack? No, it was a pointed criticism. I am Groot. Can we just focus on what happened here? I agree. The dog's investigation is our priority. And finding out what happened to Corral and Nikki. Tell me more about this job, Rodent. Why? I am attempting to find common ground with you. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. <laughs> That'll do it. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. 
Okay, we need to get to Corel's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Now you are just being spiteful. Still nothing but emergency power. Knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me to keep it away from her mom. We could sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? Nikki had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. You are fond of this girl. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay. Perhaps Lady Hellbender sent a worthy beast to devour us. Oh, yeah? How would she know we were here? It is said the Monster Queen has eyes across the galaxy. No way! Drax's rap sheet! He's gotta see this! Oh no! Please don't! Did you know this maintenance worker, Peter Quill? No. You seem relieved. I am. What the flark are you two doing? Let's go already! Now we're exploring maintenance tunnels. It can't hurt, can it? Better we check than miss something. This place don't look too safe is all. Dog report item. Strange rumbling on ship continues. Maybe keep track of your items mentally? Wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Nova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you was accurate. At the time. Here's the deal. We figure out what is going on here, and then we can figure out how to work better together. So, just ignore the obvious while it's inconvenient? Yes. First thing we do when we get back on the Milano is have a... No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa! Oh, look at you, you sexy beast! Ah, uh, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Uh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. Uh, we can use this to re-invert the core, or, uh, uh de-invert, uh, de-vert? De Rocket. Uh, the console safety lock because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. Safety locked. That's what I said. Wait, did you really just use your visor to check if I was lying? Well, stop flarking around. It ain't gonna work without the arms. Huh. Looks like the arms are stuck without any power. I bet we could jumpstart him. How? Gotta be a power cell somewhere. We gotta get them arms out. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost! Of course! Definitely something up here! Obviously! Hell yeah, it worked! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free.
All right, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. This looks good. Sure. <laughs> Discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Okay. Surprise! This whole thing's a lift. You can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova Grunts and Grease Monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta make both. Lock! Walkie clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Lord, e re-inverted the core again! Re-inverted back! Have to! He takes the heads! Don't worry! The big one has mine! This one hurts! Yeah! But try not to get shot by the big guns, bud! That fucking requires precision! Hold up for the big! What happened? Did we trip an alarm? Control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. It will not be stopped by clamps. Duh! Sneaky das bags. They scrambled the power circuit so I can't release them. I'm tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. 
You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? You should see power grids along the walls around here. Find their powered up nodes. Looking for glowy power nodes. Right. When you find them, you need to electrify the junction switch in the direction you want the power to flow. Shoot them with electricity? Yeah. We're aiming for big, glowing lines routing back towards the clamps in the middle. Possible. Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. Then you will have one. Huh. That's gotta be one of the power nodes, just need to reroute it. Groot's right. Maybe we should just call Cosmo, tell him we tried, and port the flark out of here. It ain't our fault, Scum is locked down. We will not fail at our mission. Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a root root boost thing. Did that do anything? I see it now. You've got half of it rerouted. Now work on the other room. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that. That's another power node. Group, need your help, buddy. Root boost, please. So any guesses on what they're doing with all that power? Perhaps they're recharging their personal devices. Their what? Their electronic tablets and assorted communication gadgetry. Do you think they would need power from the ship's core for that? I am no expert in Nova technology. Here's good. Group, a little help? <laughs> That's good. Okay! I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here! Solid plan! So, is there any chance of Quill getting back together with Lady Law? <laughs> She's no lady. She'd never set her standards that low anyway. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. Uh huh. Another power note. Oh, hey there. Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Yep, indubitably. Looks like you did it, Starman. Now get into the control room and hit that clamp release. I'll re re insert the core at the same time and get us moving again. You know, normally you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a disinfection on the other side. Shouldn't be concerned. Just keep an eye out for the warning signs. Mental degradation, paranoia, aggressive behavior. I feel like that's already an accurate description of our team. How will we tell? Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. Must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. And then get back to Cosmo for a reward. Alright, this is our floor. Doors are sealed tight. Just look for another way out. Gamora, can you pry that thing open for us? And bend my sword? Nope. 
Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together. Have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Yay. Great. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scott! What are these Franklin Gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know! Looks like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those kills? Don't know! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, they've been in this hangar before! Check out that giant ray thing! Can you get us across? Dog report item! We gotta destroy this thing! We don't even know what it is! Plus we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship! And us with it! Scary B! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxy's Cosmo Jack. Investigation lead him to believe Alamo is key to Galaxy Mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Ah, uh, Flark the report. Tell him his magic hand almost got us killed. Traxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is happening. They've got this giant ray thing he pointed at the planet. It's collecting some kind of energy. Have Guardian found Centurion Corel? Not yet. Guardian must find her. May have answers we need. Poor good old Contraxia! How can being shot by a giant vacuum ray not be that bad? Roar! Systems all buggy! Throw that, Trax! I'm trying to shoot you! Stop being hilarious! Get down here! Let me shoot you! The Centurion is firing! Don't feel this! Well done! He shall fly no more! More coordination between them. Follow my lead. Quill! Broke the tie in the sky 
Peter Quill, unleash me onto these fools! Shoot the energy disks on their chances! I am waiting for my chance! Okay, seems to me like this ship might be ground zero for whatever's happening. We gotta find Corral, get some real answers. You have any idea where she is? I'm thinking we check her office. I don't even know how we can get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, same way me and Nikki went last time we were here. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped after her, Peter. Uh, because it was the right thing to do. We should hurry. More zealots could arrive at any moment. The hole we saw should be on the other side of these moving batteries. Gonna need to find a way to stop them. Huh, that ain't right. Drax, gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. That seemed like a wasted effort. All plans need Steph to succeed. Uh, what new age drivel have you? Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. I'm wondering what could have been. We must move forward. Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. I just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not sneak around to find out. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. Dog report item. The rumbling. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread out. It will be contained. By, By her will. will. Move! There's too many of them! In the hole! Jump! I still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey! Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. Okay, group. I think I know my way around. We just need to get into the tunnels on the other side there. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? The Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Rick got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. Gamora, any chance you can help us here? I got this, Peter. One more time, group. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. Any new ideas on what the oversized vacuum is actually doing to Contraxia? So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corral survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. But if only one is dead? We're not betting on this! Because you know you'd lose. Because it's not appropriate. How's it not appropriate? Be careful down there, Peter Quill. Yeah! Definitely a lot sparkier than last time. Uh, make sure the kid ain't floating face up somewhere. Rocket! What? Exhaust all options! Gamora, those pipes look cuttable to you? The pipes aren't the problem. Do something about the electricity and we'll talk. That'll work. Definitely no sign of Nikki or Corel. I mean, I guess that's good news. Whoa! 
Watch out! Groot says we should start thinking about exit plans. The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. Don't suppose you've seen Nikki? I'm sorry, what? You feeling okay, Peter? It's one of Nikki's robots. She gives them names and takes care of them or whatever. It does not look taken care of to me. It does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. I am <sighs> Of course you would. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. What about your magical ice weapon, Peter Quill? Or perhaps you enjoy contemplating the intoxicating stench of death. Glorious. There! Breezy peasy! Okay, that was bad. Even for you. Ah, more death gas! Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and you hear me out on this, maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. The tension is palpable. Can you both please just get over this? Agreed. Either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Look, Rocket. I know I suck sometimes. We all suck sometimes. Pretty sure it's why we ended up together. I do not suck. Point is, I care about us. But right now, we're not the ones in danger. And Nikki's just a kid, man. As long as we're clear on the you sucking part. Clear as day. Take that thing down, will ya? Okay, I'm gonna slice it. You sure this is the right way? Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter, if Nikki and Corel really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not. No, nothing dog report worthy. Still no signs of Nikki or Corral. In the face of death's infinite mystery, Tethians are taught to focus on what is tangible. I'll keep that in mind. Investigating. Here! This is definitely the right way. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. I thought we were going to the captain's office. We are, right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki! Little one! Shoot for two! Thank you, Nikki's passkey. Ah. 
Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming our stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have her toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. As long as they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nick are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. For all we know, maybe this guy's her dad. Gee, looks like an even bigger deadbeat than you. Still can't get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Guess Nikki wasn't much of a Skrull fan. Name someone who is a Skrull fan. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. Poor Contraxia. Done in record time. Okay, where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. Should be a way to Corell's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> Guys, can we not make light of all this? We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Ditto. Admit it, Quill. The kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. If I had a kid, she or he would definitely be super cool and smart. So just like Nikki. So just like Nikki. I guess, maybe, yes. Yep, so definitely gets it from the mother's side. That's the elevator I took with Corell and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? <laughs> so much for your girlfriend meeting us. It did seem unlikely. All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just... We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corel's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. Oh yeah, he's definitely stolen. What do you expect? He's 
got the emotional maturity of a two-year-old. Are you speaking of Peter Quill? Obviously. I'll have you know, I am super emotionally mature. I have been thinking. It is customary on Katath to bathe new fathers in a river of blood. Lucky for Peter we're not on Katath. Next stop, Corell's office. Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's gotta be eating at you. None of this changes who I am. I'm still cool as a cucumber. Groot says all the cucumbers he's ever met were terrified on the inside. Well, that don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. We don't know who won. Pretty sure I know. So, where's this office, Quill? It's around here somewhere. Place wasn't this messed up last time. When in doubt, follow the stench of death. <laughs> Dog report item. We are lost. We're not lost. I just realized something. And Nikki's a tech expert, knows her way around ships fits into small spaces. Don't you dare finish that sentence. And she seems to get along well with Peter. <laughs> Good luck replacing me with a dead kid. Hello? Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. There are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer, see if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Return. Any luck getting in? Things pretty well protected. I need time. All right. Let me know. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah. This doesn't look good. Ah, oh, appealing. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree Purity Laws. What Cree Purity Laws? Corral never told you that either? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. Uh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Kree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging. This must be Corel's first kid. I remember she talked about him a lot. He was on Hala, right? When the Shatari... Yeah. Her kid and her husband. Explains how fearless she was during the war. She had nothing to lose. Oh, wow! The Kree have comic books? I am surprised. The Kree Council is very strict on approved forms of entertainment. So this could be, like, super valuable then. How valuable are we talking? Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Kree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. 
Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Okay, so it looks like the church is behind this. You should call the dog to be- Oh, crap. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop moving. The warrior does not hesitate, Peter Quill. Okay, let's be careful. He says after you. Shh. Voice is down. like an unproven warrior's first fight. And if it continues this way, it's gonna be our last. Come on, guys. They're not the first ones to try us, and they won't be the last. We have filled many graves. Right? There's been a thousand before them, and they all found out fast. Guardians don't break. Who's with me? Today, I am wait to destroyer. take him down. Time to... Come over and slice him up. Looks like we bombs! Toss them around! Anyone else think that we need a robot in our team? Yeah! I was kind of thinking that! Let's see that sword! I'm on it! So is this thing here to protect the servers then? I don't know! Everything about this is just getting more and more important! We must tell the dog about the priest! Robot priest! Are you? Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? I can't just plug servers into my skull. That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. So according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Come on! <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. I 
have never understood how so much information can be stored in such a magical way. What? You mean servers? All of it. Servers, computers, technology. So you basically don't understand anything I do? Precisely. world mine seems to have gone completely dark. But there's an open panel up in the corner there. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panic scampering is what caused the final break. Hey, Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this passkey she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next... Never in! You're kidding! Well... Yes! Guys, we're in! Huh. I've always wanted to see my record. Gotta be something in here. Hey, isn't that the mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone? Yeah. When's the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. The journey to Corral. Found something. after we left. Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. <laughs> no, you're a lotus scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. <sighs> that gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? <laughs> you're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Guardians of the galaxy. You misread our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifice is much. I had the check. Crew, sweep the leg. Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corral and her daughter? You came here seeking. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. Okay, that is really not cool. What do you mean he's not picking up? Come! 
and make sure you are cool.